Can you hear Jesus? Yeah. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> a city that shouldn't exist. A tax haven where corporations and criminal empires reign supreme. In this place, all human life has been infected with nano machines to keep them in check. Over them stand the white knights who ensure that. Okay. <laughs> Here, brutally, brutality in all its forms is an everyday reality. The quality of life for the non parallel from decreases at an alarming rate. For many, this can be overwhelming. Some about themselves and their jobs, their families, or even their studies. Some look for ways to escape this place, and others just give up. But for many of them, the answer lies at the bottom of the glass. That's, that's called alcoholism. It's called this game is way too fucking loud. <laughs> Oh, I thought it was just me. Oh yeah, it's Wow! It's all oasis in the middle of the concrete desert. A fountain of spirits waiting for tired souls. Yeah, it's a bar. It's a bar game. It's about a bar, okay? We get it. People are sad and they want out. <laughs> People are sad and want to drown their sorrows. <laughs> I would like this game to be in full screen, like window full screen, but it's not gonna happen so much. Alright. <sighs> Is the game still stupidly loud for you? Yeah, but I'm fixing it. That's there... on my own thing to do. Are there separate audio tracks for myself and the game? Yeah, there are actually. Ooh! Intuitive Discord. Well, what's I know, game? smart. Once you get that sort, we have a prologue to play. Ooh, pro- uh, I wonder if it's the one with the, the corgis, because she always talks about <laughs> it. Yeah, we didn't get too far into this game, but I remember the corgi part. I'm just gonna select day one of the prologue, Friday, December 9th. Good evening. Good, good. Get get evening, sure. Get evening. Get even. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> oh, is this the boss? Yes. <laughs> well, at least one of my employees showed up. Huh? What about Gil? Gil's a loser. <laughs> he <laughs> he mumbled something about holes and posts and asked for a couple of days off. Business as usual, then. He's still a fucking freak. I was like, holes and posts. I, like, I think it said pests. Oh, okay. I was like, posts, and I was like, what? <laughs> you mean posts, like Tumblr? <laughs> it's, it's holes. <laughs> Not quite. How so? Uh, I mean, us. Not, not kill. Business will be a tad different through the weekend. We are booked. <laughs> That's a new one. Who made the booking? The Cfar. Oh, <laughs> Cfar Toy Company. They make toys for dogs. It's the anniversary or something like that. We usually don't reserve the bar. Why do it this time? Because you like dogs, you sick fuck? <laughs> <laughs> you, you caught me. <laughs> the clients are adorable. Excuse me? <laughs> They're so cute. <laughs> You'll see. <laughs> wow. Anything special I should know? They're dogs. <laughs> They'll give you a ticket to trade and for a drink they want. Just do your usual thing! Oh, they're, like, catering, so, yeah. Fair enough. I'll be in my office! Call if you need me! Sure. I need you now. Come back, please. <laughs> well then. I need an adult. <laughs> Already. <laughs> Time to mix drinks and change lives. <laughs> his, his name Pumple is I Lord love Pumble Rump. <laughs> Mm, yes. <laughs> um, excuse me, I'll have the grizzly temple. <laughs> <laughs> Hello? 
A, a dog? A dog? <laughs> a, t a talking dog? My dreams. Uh, are you with the Seafar Toy Company? Yeah. Did I arrive too early? He's wearing a bow tie. He's such cat! <laughs> <laughs> no, no. The man of my dreams. <laughs> the clients are adorable. Son of a bitch. <laughs> grizzly Temple, right? Come here right up. This dog wants I like a... this Grizzly Temple. Grizzly Temple. This dog wants a Grizzly Temple, right? Is this a real drink? I don't think any of these are real drinks. Well, the Piano Man's a real drink. I don't know, let's look it up. I don't know what my drinks yet. Let's learn something new. Oh, music skipping the pit. I heard that. <laughs> heard that too. It's in the wiki for the game. Maybe it doesn't really exist. Grizzly Bear cocktail, but no. The drink doesn't actually exist. Three out of life. One. One. Two. Three. Three Bronson extract. One. Two. Three. Three powder delta, one powder tree, all blended. This one is kind of unbearable. It's supposed to be for fans of the movie it was used in. <laughs> unbearable. <laughs> Great, get it. Uh, how do I? How do I serve? Grab it. Oh, okay. Looks <laughs> <laughs> like oh, I don't want to play this game. <laughs> Here we go. Thanks. He just fucking walked away. He didn't stay to chat. What the fuck? Did you even give me your drink ticket? <laughs> this is gonna be a long weekend, isn't it? Hey, give us a drink ticket. Ariel Wienerton. <laughs> <laughs> I like this. <laughs> but okay, but is it a classy lady then? Yeah, I'll do. It. I'll do it. It's fine. Hello! Is the Bronson extract here produced using organic roots? I don't... I don't know. <laughs> Accurate! <laughs> Anyone I can talk to about that? Here? Me? Right, right now? No. But you should have that information on hand! Every BTC certified bar is no different from a fast food chain. We get the same supplies as everyone else. Ask BTC officials if you want to know. But you should! But we don't. But! <laughs> saying that we should over and over again is not going to change reality. Give me something with lots of Bronson extract, then. Okay. You just a Wait, <laughs> you just asked to make sure if it was organic, and then we don't know if it's organic. Bronson extract... Uh, I don't really know what Bronson extract signifies. That's two. Two blood. I feel like the Adelhide is like what's it called? The the sweet pink stuff that we were talking about the other day. I mean it, uh, The stuff you put in Shirley Temple. Grenadine. Yeah, grenadine. I think it's supposed to be grenadine. Mm. There's three for the grizzly temple. There's five and a gut punch, Jesus! There's six <laughs> and a Mars blast. Alright, so we got six and a Mars blast so far. Mars blast wins! Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, <laughs> one. I'm just thinking, like, can we just fill their drink with, <laughs> with Bronson? <laughs> One of these is there enough to leave your face red like the actual plant. Yeah! I just give her a full drink of Bronson extract, like, fuck you! <laughs> this is what you wanted, right? Here. What the hell is this? Your order. <laughs> this is what Bronson extract tastes like? Sorta, yeah. Well, fuck that noise! It's not worth the effort! 
<laughs> you asked for this. No, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> oh, mystery. She kind of looks emo. It kind of looks like an android. E emo android. Yeah, girl. Ugh. Uh, excuse me. <laughs> I'm, going to, I'm not sure if it's a guy or a girl. Thank God, a person. <laughs> well, you're very off base. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. There we go. Hey, oh, skill lines are on. Abort. Well, as much as a person as the. Dis this is me a driver can be. What I mean is, why are there so many goddamn dogs? Why dogs? Why? Well, the Corkies created the CFR toy company and they've been doing a great job, so the dogs made the company. A company run exclusively by dogs, really? By dogs for the dogs. <laughs> and a good one at that. Their only problem is that they have a not so discreet preference for hiring corgis exclusively. Racism. Casual racism. Why? Something about. Whoa! <laughs> Casual racism. <laughs> Casual Something racism. about being more comfortable around their own kind. Are you with them? You're not a corgi. I'm a corgi on the inside. But I do prefer corgis, but... No, I mean, are you working with them? Well, I'm only here because the law requires at least one humanoid on payroll. Does the law really cover such scenarios? Yeah, it does. Why take a job like this? That's... That's true. <laughs> I feel like this is a much more happier person than I had thought. <laughs> <laughs> because I, it means I'm surrounded by corgis all day long. Designated... Ba-ba-da-da. Da-da-da-da <laughs> driver. <laughs> I can't say designated. <laughs> Diggory do driver woes aside. <laughs> designated driver's woe well aside. It's the closest thing to heaven. Although, to be fair, I'm not much of a drinker anyway. I see. Well, to each their own. Are you gonna drink anything? Do you have anything non-alcoholic? Let's see what I can fetch you. <laughs> Did you intend to make that pun? Are you being racist? Casually racist? <laughs> a, a pun? Never mind. You want something non-alcoholic? Well, bottle drinks. I assume. Every drink here is priced at $500. <laughs> 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 And it's 500 yen. Isn't the alcohol They're like karma treat? $5 drinks. I think so, I think. Hey, look. Bleeding Jane. <laughs> Spicy, classic, and sobering. <laughs> Optional. You don't have to put any in here. That's true. I don't. I'm a Let's do the option. Ooh, optional. <laughs> Preface spike. I don't like that name. It's sobering, so I'm assuming it's like it packs a punch. We could also just give him the fedora. No, that. sobering would mean. <laughs> <laughs> sobering would mean you'd be like trying to get off the alcohol. Yeah, but isn't something sobering like fucking hot sauce or whatever? I guess so, like hot sauce or like citrus. It would be like something that packs a punch, even though it doesn't That's really have alcohol in it. Did he want something that packs a punch? No, he didn't want it. He wants something not popping. Which is this? Because it's we do the... <laughs> Here's a fedora! <laughs> Hello. 
skill set. Mix. Stop. Here you go. Thanks. I guess. I'm not actually sure that's <laughs> not alcoholic. <laughs> it's in a bottle, I assume it's not. Pretty sure. Okay. <laughs> Listen, I need to know. Is it really gonna be only corgis today? Is that well, all I'm gonna do all night? Serve the same kind of dog over and over? The vast majority of them are Pembroke Welsh corgis. That sounds super cute. Mm -hmm. There are a couple of cardigan Welsh corgis, though. But the relationship between the two breeds is tad difficult. So the cardigans weren't invited. Racism. I didn't know there was so much racism amongst the dog community. <laughs> I wasn't aware there was so much fucking racism here. <laughs> God. <laughs> so yeah, I guess you'll be serving the same kind of dog all night. No, I mean... <laughs> isn't there some other human I might talk to today? Am I not good enough? No. There's a woman on staff, but she couldn't come today. I- Okay, stop giving me pointless things! <laughs> Who is here? Oh boy. Is that a problem somehow? Do you not like corgis? It's not really a problem. We've survived worse than this. Like that time when an AA meeting came here asking for non-alcoholic stuff only. But just thinking about the fact that I'm serving drinks to dogs. That at some point, all the choices in my life led to me serving drinks to a group of talking dogs. It's one of those moments that makes you want to stop and rethink where your life is going. That actually sounds kind of nice, like an AA meeting that went to a bar. So they like going to bars, but they all just drank non-alcoholic stuff. That was kind of nice, actually. It seems a bit weird, though. Like, well, oh, we're recovering alcoholics. Let's go to the only place they serve alcohol. A bar. <clears throat> Maybe it's a test of will. Do you perhaps not like this job? I do. I can get you fired. <laughs> I love every second of this job. But dogs. It's like a oh. fashion designer suddenly realizing he's been designing edible underwear. I still don't see a problem with the dogs, but I'm not going to froze the subject. Yeah, I don't, I don't really see the problem. <laughs> I'm going to try entertaining myself for a bit. I mean, they're like sentient dogs. The stuff for playing pool is underneath the table. There are also darts in the box next to the cute box. Great, thanks for the information. It's not like my dog friends can play with me. Call if you need another drink. Sure. <laughs> Lady Banner, I'm feeling happy, so I'll give everyone a round. Actually, it's a free bar. I won't let you spoil my mood. I want a fringe weaver. <laughs> I'm gonna write the fuck up. This dog wants a fringe weaver. I, I was hoping there'd be more dog based drinks. Jesus. Oh my god, it's just straight alcohol oh, and a little two, bit of sugar. Three, four, oh look, it's like drinking <laughs> ethnic alcohol with a spoonful of sugar. <laughs> All aged and mixed. How are we aging it? I don't know. <laughs> Here you go. Still an awesome day. Dragon fucker. <gasps> Hold oh on. my god. I got this one. <clears throat> Yo, what's an alpha male gotta do to get some service? What, <laughs> what may I serve you? Oh, my microphone just peeped the fuck out. <laughs> oh well, whatever. Serve me some justice. <laughs> Beer and quickly. Coming right up. This <sighs> dog. Why is your once a beer. Why is your name? Why is your name Dragonfucker? <laughs> Why is your name Dragonfucker? 
You can pick your own name. Traditionally, brewed beer has become luxury, but this one's pretty close to the real deal. Adelaide, Broadson, that one, Flanagai, Flanagai, one, two, three, four, all mixed. Here. Here you are. Damn, you're a slow piece of shit! Uh. <laughs> hey boss! My heart. What was the opposite of deja vu again? Jammy SV. Yeah, that! <laughs> <laughs> Are you having a premonition? Something like that. That dog felt uncannily familiar. Are you bored? Not really. I was playing with the darts a bit ago. I thought about playing pool, but all the other clients are. I, I told you! <laughs> I thumbed challenged. Sorry if this sounds rude, but why was the dart box so dusky? You're the first person in the year or so I've been here that has actually played with darts. I think even my boss forgot they existed. By the way, how are the dogs as clients? Well, I don't really like dragons. We've had worse, but why the fuck was that one called Dragon Fucker? <laughs> Have you had someone come in and gnaw chairs to pieces? Yes, she was testing out her new mechanical teeth. She got banned from entering any BDC bar after that. With anecdotes like... Well, with anecdotes like those, you'd think serving dogs would feel totally normal. You'd be wrong, because even then, we were talking about humans. I mean, don't get me wrong, I've served a dog or two in my time, but they usually come in with someone. And they never talk. And I think about it, are these drinks bad for dogs? Ah, Probably. And now you worry about that? But no, they aren't. Only cappuccino monkeys are at risk if they drink those chemicals. Anyway, you want anything to drink? How do you know this? <laughs> surprise me, but keep it non-alcoholic. Sure. Non-alcoholic surprise, whatever that means. Let's find out. No one has alcohol. Cracks a punch. No one has alcohol. No one doesn't. Leading James. That's it. Let's find the one that makes me the most money. <laughs> okay. The Not this one. No. Not this one. No. 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 No, no. No, no, no. 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 Wait, this is a free bar. None of this makes us funny. That's true. <laughs> it doesn't matter. I'll That's just the blue fairy. Oh, Sparkle Star! Sweet girly hat. We don't even know what gender this person is. I'm assuming. I'm assuming, I'm assuming nothing, because I can't tell. <laughs> they were like, well, there is a woman that works here, so it implied that they were Maybe not Maybe it's a, a man. Woman. It's just, well, it's, it's a neither, because it's not a people. It comes that across much. as pretty... masculine. Uh. Uh. Them. I don't either. Here you go. Here you go. Thank you. <laughs> this might sound weird to ask, but they talk through their collars, right? That's right. Oh, they invented that. How do they work? It's not hard, really. They're just translators. They read the dog's brains and turn their thoughts into words. Do keep in mind that today's dog breeds have more cognitive capacity than their ancestors. If you put the translator on dogs for a decade ago, from a decade ago, they wouldn't work like they do now. Yeah, I read something about that once. Another question. Why do they wear those small tuxedos? Because it's cute. <laughs> oh, yeah, because it's good for PR. <laughs> you don't say. Well, it'll be a bit before we go for the day. Any other questions? Yes. Why the fuck do these dogs want to get drunk? I see humans do it, and they think it might be fun. I can, I can understand. Just that. like teens, then. 
Teens. Teens. <laughs> These hipsters and hooligans. <laughs> teenagers. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'll go play darts by myself. Satan's helper? Why? I love him. Why do they have I such love him already. Names? What? Because they're dogs that came up with their own names. What can I serve? Spot was my slave name. <laughs> Moon. Excuse me. Moon. A uh, moon blast? Moon. A big moon blast? Moon. Alright then. <laughs> this dog wants a big moon blast. You just double it, then. I remember that much. I think. One, yeah. two, three, four, five, six, four. Come on, just put those in. It's okay, we need two of those anyway. One, two, three, four, five, six. Can I just click them? No. <laughs> Got dragon. On the rocks and wood. Wow! Shake it. Here. Moon! Is that a good moon or a bad moon? Bad moon rising. Aww! <laughs> this one's name is Pesky Furball, so you get to voice it. <laughs> <laughs> hey! We pick a say! Pick a say! Look a say! <laughs> a crevice spike? Sure. Oh, is he speaking Pig Latin? Yes. Ah! Oh, yay! Mister. Understand, yay! I could never understand Pig Latin. It's like. I understand what it is, I just could not formulate the words in my brain. Yeah, and I don't understand why it exists. I was a kid too. This dog wants a crevice spike. Two powder delta. Four of those at optional damage run. So you get two. Just a lot of it. <laughs> you get four. Fill it. <laughs> All blip. Time to get drunk. That's not correct. It says cry spec. Why does it say that? That's not a drink. Is that just a a shortening of credits into cry? Or did I make the wrong trick? <laughs> no, he said he wanted a crevice spike. Yeah, he said he wanted a crevice spike, but it says cry spike there. I think it I think it's C R V. I think it's a short. Yeah, so there is no cry spike. Underappreciated drink. What the fuck? There's a drink. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Hank stay. All right, one more drink before we wrap things up. I'm just thirsty. I'm not actually getting drunk. What do you want? I'm not picky. Give me anything. Of course, anything. He said. The fairy. The fairy. I think it's blue fairy. Blue fairy. Two, three, four, one. Aged and mixed. <laughs> See, Dr. Gurley, just like you, because I don't know what you are. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Thanks. Wait, we never asked. You can go. <laughs> so, what exactly do you do? Sorry if it's rude to ask. I'm the designated driver. <laughs> Office boy, there we go. <laughs> we have a gender! <laughs> I guess I am what people call an office boy. My duties usually involve looking for things, answering a few calls, that sort of stuff. But this being a dog-run company, there are a lot more responsibilities. Like getting stuff off the shelves and opening windows. At least they pay well. Yo, that I, sounds like a great job. I would totally do a job working with dogs that don't have thumbs that need you to do things that require thumbs. 
Working with Dragon Fucker is my dream. <laughs> what can Elf Man do to get Office Boy around here? Did you read this line? Sorry, I kind of went oh. off on a tangent. At least they pay well. I think I did say that. I see. And how did you end up in that position? Where did you get that offer? <laughs> Indeed. <laughs> Indeed.com. <laughs> My neighbor is the owner of one of the dogs. He told me they needed thumbs. Figures. They are celebrating the company's anniversary, right? Yeah, five years ago, three corgis became dissatisfied with the quality of existing dog toys. So they founded this company. They got the money for their, from their owners, if I remember correctly. That would make sense. I can see that happening. Somehow. Somewhere. The STC is the second biggest dog toy company in the world. By the dog for the dog. Fun fact, they started as CFAR Toy Development. That makes sense because they were still developing it. Ain't that unfortunate. STD. Wow. Who are you? Ew! Here, uh, <laughs> <Ew>, Milo! <laughs> oh, I remember. Do you think I remember this one? Oh, uh, it's up. Uh, it's the sex bot android. Yeah, the one that looks like a child. Is he disturbing? <laughs> the bot's uh, <laughs> uh, I felt I bad. Can't. <laughs> I'll do it, it's fine. <laughs> the bar's favorite sweetheart has arrived! Why are you quiet? I'm waiting for the audience's cheers to stop! This isn't a sitcom. Ah, oh, honey, oh. how innocent! <laughs> um, it, excuse me, you are... I'm you, but better. <laughs> I'm the lovely Dorothy Hayes, and you're sir- Wait! Get out of my face. You're a Lilum! Not at your service, then! That's don't, rude. Don't be rude to the other clients. She's kind of a regular here. Kind of? I've been coming here religiously for the past three months now! Three months! I come here to see your charming face, and you say I'm just kind of a regular? For shame, honey. For shame. For shame. <laughs> I'm sorry, I guess. Nothing a free drink will solve! Won't do. Huh? You playing hard to get? Even if I wanted to give you a drink, we're booked for the whole weekend. Don't you think you should at least put a sign out front or something? Hey, I only found out myself just a few minutes ago. She could have one of my tickets if you're okay with it. Don't be nice to her, she was rude to you. <laughs> I see no problem. Oh, you're so sweet! If you were at least 40% organic, I would give you a discount. Discount? You don't need to know. So, don't who booked you? This guy? Yep, he's rich. The Seafar Toy Company. What do they do? We, um... They create door dog toys. Oh, lovely! It's also run by dogs. Oh! By dogs for the dogs. Don't joke like that! You think I'd kid about something like that? Wait, you mean that if I turn around, I'd s s s see dogs? Oh no, she's scared of dogs. Yeah, didn't you see them when you came in? Uh, uh, I just entered without looking anywhere else but the bar! Just like me. <laughs> <laughs> You look... troubled. I, I'm not too much of a dog p p person I, I even charge extra if my clients want it doggy style. Doggy... What? You don't <laughs> need to know. Stop! He's my precious boy! <laughs> I'm gonna take this ticket to trade to next Monday! I'm leaving right now! The ticket would've expired by then, though. She looks like the kind of girl that will hold you to your promise, regardless. Isn't that obvious? Well, 
I have to gather the cabs outside. Keep it up, bartender. Good night. Yeah, you too. Good night. Come again. Howdy, howdy. Alright, sirs. The night is o night's over. You have kennels you need to return to. How are these, like, still owned by people? <laughs> All done! Yeah. Boss, how do you end up being booked by dogs? I know some dogs myself! I think we all know dogs. Huh. And you told me we're booked the whole weekend, right? That's right! Well... Please bear with it! We're all doing our part after all! Yeah, yeah. We weren't here. <laughs> well, I gotta go for today, bye. Take care! <laughs>